And that is my 50th farming contract right there. We started like four days ago, five days ago. I can't really remember exactly, but we're already one third of the way to the final task, which is 150 farming uh, contracts. So I think I should be able to do it. I was super worried about this, but yeah, we're giga chilling. Also at 292 Seracnus kill count, 42 past the final KC task, still no cudgel, unfortunately. Got to like 400 Seracnus KC, still no cudgel, but yeah, it is what it is. We're gonna go back to enchanting this thing now, or doing a uh, MTA now. Back to it. We only really need 100 more Teleconnect Pizzazz points, I'm pretty sure. Alright, that is the 480, uh, what's it called? Telekinetic points that I need, that I need so we're good on that. We're out of here. Bro, I've kind of just been AFK autopiloting. I went 70 points over the fucking, what's it called? Uh, the thingy for the Pizzazz points. It is what it is. We move on. We've got... Oh, actually, I did need 530. Damn, no, I didn't go AFK. Bro, I'm smart as hell. I actually needed 530, it says on the wiki. So I got 480 Telekinetic, 530 Alchemy. Um, I need 480 graveyard and 4,800 enchantments. So let's go do the graveyard now. Okay, and that is that room done. 480 points exactly. How do I even get out of here? There. All I have to do now is, um, the enchantment room, which I need 48,000, 48,000, 4,800 points. All right, we're done with this. Actually very quick, well, quick in relative regard, obviously because of the relics. So I'm very happy with that. Let's go buy the master wand. Okay, so the reason I got so many points is because you actually have to buy each wand first. So confirm beginner wand, confirm apprentice wand, confirm teacher wand, and finally confirm master wand. There we go. We're not going to put this on just yet, nor are we going to put the insignia on just yet. Wearing the master wand is 125 points, and wearing a Kodai wand is 250 points. So that's 375 points. I just have banked pretty much. Still in some crystal implants so that other people can't have them. You know the vibes. Do X2 crystal elven signet? I'll be so pissed, not going to lie. Maybe I shouldn't do this. All right, we've got the 100 shards we need now for the Celestial Signet. We just need the Stardust, which I'll get when I go eat. Um, and we'll probably save that too. We're going to go do some Vedion kills. I know I already got the Guardian Boots really early from Grotesque, but there are still Casey tasks for it. And uh, there's 225 points to get, because I still need a Granite Hammer or a Ring, which is 50 points. 100 KC is 50 points, and then 250 KC is uh, 50 points. All right, let's go kill 250 Grotesque Guardians real quick. Well... Real quick is a relative term. Oh, I got the granite gloves again, which are the same drop rate as the hammer and the other thing. Uh, the ring. No points out of it. Bro, I just got the fucking thing for the, what's it called, guardian boots again. Obviously, I've already got them. That means nothing to me. I want the hammer or the ring. Finally getting some good time. 057. Oh, yeah, we got the granite ring. Where is it? Granite ring. I'm trying to save ticks there. Equip a granite hammer or a granite ring. 50 points right there. 62,105 now. Gonna go to 100 and then 250 KC. There's no more drops to get, really, but... I just want to do it. And that is defeat the Grotesque Guardians 100 times. Also a hard combat task. Grotesque Guardians Adept. Very, very nice. 100 kill count, 50 points. 62,155. Another 150 kills, another 125 points. So let's go towards that. Damn, we got the Granite Hammer too. Doesn't give us any more points because we already got the ring or whatever. Bro, I got my third thing for the Guardian Boots. Someone is watching this video right now and they are mad. They are mad, mad. Fair enough, bro. I could make three Guardian Shoes. You probably can't even make one. There's a Granite Ring. Granite ring at a uh, 224kc, already got one though. Okay, I don't know why I decided to do this, because this took way longer than I imagined, and I already had all the drops, but I mean, we com <laughs> we committed, right? 250 grotesque, 125 points, 62,280. Let's take rank 3 now. Okay, let's make a celestial ring real quick. Make celestial ring, 125 points. Let's wear a master wand. 125 points. Let's put the Kodai on the master wand. Go ahead. 250 points. And now let's hit something else for our final. And this right here is crafting 50 water runes, getting me 5 league points. Yep, you know, we've got to leave some things for the combo breakers. We are now officially rank 3. We are closer to rank 1 than we ever have been before. Trust me, guys. I know it might not look like it, but we are. I actually haven't been able to upload a video every day because I've been so busy point chasing that I'm actually super behind on uploads. But that does mean I should have a video out tomorrow and the day after tomorrow too with even more progress. I am very sorry for missing those videos, but guys, I do still ask one thing of you. We have a YouTube algorithm to finesse. It's the best way to support my channel. The best way, ideally, is to get the most subscribers possible per video. So really quickly, if you could double check down below that you are subbed, and if you're not, hit that button. Helps me out a ton. Leaving a like and leaving a comment goes an extra way too, but you know, I don't want to ask all that of you guys, but you guys do whatever you want. Appreciate the support once again. Let's carry on with the video. 417 KC drive for the cudgel. It's literally like not even worth my time. I think I'm gonna go do some Vedion. All right, Vedion seems to be working fine just with the same ballista, uh, Callisto setup. 
ancient staff drop. What the damn hell? So I was killing video and I realized I've never actually got my basilisk drop for the upgraded helm of Nezi. And on on Toss, it's only in a 100, 1 in 3, 3, 3 drop rate. So it should get it pretty quickly, I'm hoping. Um, so yeah, we're just going to go do that first because uh, it is pretty AFK and I can sort of chill. And I've been sort of just rushing things all day today. So I just want to chill a bit. Super quick and AFK task, got to eat some KFC while we did it, you know the vibes. Basilisk jaw, didn't go dry on it thankfully, and didn't go too AFK that I couldn't even pick it up. Shout out solo mission, and that's another 125 points in the bag. Alright, let's make this basilisk jaw, attach the jaw to the helmet, wear it for 125 points, 62,910. We can't really use this because I don't have a, what's it called, I don't have a war blessing. So I need to keep the bandos full helm on or another piece of bandos for the bandos set effect. So it's not worth using. I don't want to waste the time going to do clues right now. Uh, it is something I probably will do eventually, but it's not that big a deal, to be honest. I really don't think. It's only a couple of max hits, and the bandos effect is much more useful. Going to go catch up on some editing now. 500 Sriracha kills, and we're still dry for this cudgel, bro. We are wasting so much time. 550 KC dry of this little fucking, what's it called? Little uh, cudgel. We're just going to go back to Vedion now. Another deep pick to the collection at 31 KC. No way, I just lost another Infernal Cave, bro. I am, I am fumed. I'm actually fumed. Time to go run back another Inferno, I guess. I'm going real low HP for this. Because I want to do another zero set. I wish I hit. Oh my god, we're not zero setting shit at this rate. There we go. Okay, I think we should be on pace now. Yep. We're about to hit it to 480. I might want to drink some brews. Come on. Healer's going to spawn. Let's see what the DPS is in. Little bit of a miscalculation there. Slight miscalculations, nothing too wrong. All part of God's plan. I don't want to tag that last heal, I feel like it's not worth it. Especially now that I have a SAR effect going. Dead? Nice. Okay, that should be healers. Running with the shield, don't choke. Oh shit, it's down there. Nice. 106. Dead, nice. Okay, what's the time? 445.22. We absolutely take that. We've got the Infernal Cape back. And we can go back to uh, Vedion. Back to Vedion now. We're going to do a little bit better job, hopefully, at avoiding the little splashy things. All right, I'm a Vedion Adept. That's 50 KC. Hopefully, we don't have to kill too many more for this final ring. I just lost another one, bro. I'm not- I'm- I'm so mad. I'm so mad, bro. I died again. I'm actually so mad. I was sitting 33 HP like a cuck. So far, nothing again. Hate to see it. Come on, surely I do 400 damage. Surely I do 400 damage by the time I get back. Otherwise, I'm in for a painful set. Oh no, I don't like the odds of this. Damn, wow, this is actually super awkward. Guess I'm healing up. That was actually so awkward. Just been off this major. Nice. That's a Jad. That's hopefully a dead Jad. Yep. Let's get back to it. Can we spawn healers right away? 
Yep. Probably gonna drink some brews here just so I don't die to this. I beg, there we go, new personal best as well, 4357. And we have another Infernal Cape to go loot. All right, we are once again going to Vedion. I'm not camping low HP for Knife's Edge this time. I'm safe and I don't give a fuck. What a cute little combat task named Veteran, I get it, because it's called Vedion. Ha, ha, ha. But still no ring, so we go again. We keep going, we game, we game on. 108 KC, another D pick. Where's the ring at? Where's the fucking ring at? 131 KC, Ring of the Gods, let's go, we're done, bro. No more Infernal Capes to be lost, that's the greatest news I've ever heard. 125 League Points, we're now over 63,000 points. Absolutely take those. I'm a very, very happy gamer. Only took us, like, 50 kills, thankfully. Let's go do Vorkath. Okay, not sure what the best setup is nowadays, but we will figure it out as time goes on. Uh, yeah. Alright, that is 300 kill count, 200 more to go for the first 125 point task. If we get the Dragon Bone Necklace, that's 125 points. 250 points when we make it into a Bone Crusher Necklace. If we get the Wyvern Shield, that's huge, it's 125 points. And then it's another 250 points once we get the Ancient Wyvern Shield too. We got the Dragon Bone Necklace, 331 KC, 125 League Points just like that, 63,160. I need to go do the Mauritania Hard Diary and I can make this into a Bone Crusher Necklace. And that's another 125 points. That's one in 333, so we're almost directly on the drop rate for that. So that's pretty sick. I'm not going to leave Warcast just yet, though. I got another Dragon Bone Necklace. No points from that, obviously, but yeah. Another Dragon Bone Necklace. God, I just want to spoon the Skeletal Wyvern Shield or whatever. The Dragonfire Ward thingy. And that is 500 Warcast, Casey. Unfortunately, we did not spoon the Wyvern Shield. But that is 125 lead points. 60,285. Some very fast kills, our personal best is still at 0, 016, however, there's still 250 more KC as a task to do, but obviously not going to do that right now. Brain's a little fried. Um, I really hope we get spooned that shield before 750, otherwise we're going to be wasting hours and hours here. It is 1 in 1.3k, so you do have to get lucky here for it, but yeah, it is just one of those RNG things. I think I'm going to move on to the Mauritania Hard Diary now to get this Dragon Bone Necklace into a Bone Crusher Necklace for another 125 points. And doing the diary itself will give me some points. Alright, that is the Mauritania Easy Diary done. Let's move on to the Medium, allegedly. Alright, just completed the Mauritania Medium Diary as well. 25 League Points off that one. 63,315. Let's go do and complete the hard. That should be the Mauritania Hard Diary done. Let's go get- the, that's 50 points as well. Let's go get uh, this Bone Crusher or whatever. Make this necklace and then we can eat some food. Let's go, we finally got some Mori legs. Probably should have done this diary a lot sooner, but you know, it is what it is. All right, use Bone Crusher on this and that. Proceed with combination. Wear Bone Crusher, bone crusher Necklace. Another 125 League Points. 63,490. Shout out to the guy in the comment section who's been telling me to eat nuts. I've just been one tick in some of them IRL. Now let's go do some CM, see if we can pull some more purples. As and nothing. And nothing. And nothing. And a dupe buckler. Now, I don't know if this actually counts towards the gain 10 uniques task. I think it does, which is another 125 points. So while it's not any points just like that, because I've already, already got a buckler, uh, it might stack up for some more points later. So it is what it is. And nothing. And nothing. And nothing. And nothing. 59 total KC now with the one normal cox. 58 CMs, obviously. Just a dupe dex, or a dupe dex, a uh, dupe buckler. Still missing all the ancestral pieces, a DHCB. Uh, we're still missing augury too. Uh, but yeah, apart from that, we got quite a few nice drops. At 73 farming contracts, for those of you who are interested, guys, I'm now at over 200 kids to feed and I'm struggling. Please right now scroll down for half a tick, click the subscribe button, like the video, and comment down below praying for me and my family so that the YouTube algorithm can take this video to a million views and help me put some food on the table. I love you guys once again, the support has been amazing, thank you for watching, and I will see you soon.